Welcome back. Today we're going to look at sum if function versus using a pivot table. So right here we've got our table of data and it uh, looks like a table of sales given reps, regions, and amounts and their sales and their clients and their projects. So we're going to go, let's say we want to, we want to uh, just total up the sales for a certain rep. So we're going to go here, we're going to, let's say we're using the FI rep. We're going to use our sum if function. Sum if. And the range is the range where we're going to look for our key. And the F4. In case we want to copy it down. And the criteria is where we're going to find what we're looking for. And the sum range is the amount that we're going to sum up over a given range. F4. To lock that in place. Now, let's say we want to just do this here for all of them. We can say, we can say unique. We can make a unique list equals unique. And the array is here. This is where all these names are. And close that off. Boom, done. Then we can take this, this, and you know to double to, to copy it down, you just double click this. Boom, it's done. So in that short instance, you just created a sum of all the sales for each rep in this area. So then if we can look at this as compared to a pivot table, so a pivot table is actually quite simple to do. We're gonna select our data, just like we did over here. Insert, pivot table. We're gonna leave all this as it is and it's just gonna create a brand new tab with the pivot table in it. Boom, okay, now we have this blank canvas here. What we're gonna do, we're gonna take, we're gonna take our rep, we're gonna move it down into rows, so there's our rep. And then we're gonna take our amount, we're gonna move it into values. There you go. Format cells. Or, excuse me, number formatting. We want it to be currency. Boom, it's all done. So two different ways you can you can slice and dice data. Of course, the pivot table is a little bit more uh, it's a little bit more robust, and there's other things you can do within the pivot table. And we do have other videos on that as well. So um, please leave us a thumbs up if you like the video. Please subscribe if you'd like to get content as it becomes available, and check out our website for more information about what we do and who we serve. Thanks for viewing. Talk to you soon.